wall right there. We have never seen anything like this and are still trying to understand what happened. Animal and pest control have been unable to offer any reasonable or consistent explanation. The questions remain, what are they? Where did they come from? And why are they here? The police have killed what appear to be the last of them, but many people are severely injured. Earlier reports have suggested that the creatures were born from an experiment or a formula concocted by students at the local town camp, which is known for enrolling troubled youth. Camp administrators deny any and all such allegations. That is what made our summer program popular. But no one was ever able to discover the root cause of the outbreak. I believe, with a little research, we can offer an analysis and conclusion about what occurred. How many of you will be going to college this fall? Good. Well, if you go to a state school, you can get scholarship money, including tuition and housing for your first year. Did y'all see that? See what? That, the, the guy, look, rewind it. There. And tell me I see this guy. Blow it up. Now play it again. What is he doing? I bet you the government's behind this. They're the ones experimenting and causing all these problems. Analysis and conclusion completed. Can I get my scholarship money, please? Come on. Oh, come on. Just because you see a guy with a stupid box doesn't mean there's something in it or that it's the government. Really? Zach, I have to say I agree with Ashley on this. There was no evidence of government involvement. And that guy you see might be an innocent bystander with no connection to the incident whatsoever. Then what's your explanation for it then, huh, Miss Reynolds? I don't trust them. I bet you they play some right in this for some purpose. That's what we need to be analyzing, why they did it. Then the media, all they do is put fear in us. They make up shit like this to make people feel anxious and crazy and blame innocent people for it, like us. Watch your language in this class. Your assignment is to take what we do know and offer some sort of explanation. Channel 3 has been waiting for information on this. Hey, if the government's out to get us, why don't they just get us? What do you mean? I mean, they have all the resources they need to do whatever they want to do. If they're trying to kill off everyone in town with scorpion attacks or whatever, what happened? I mean, it looked like the police stopped it. Thank God. <laughs> and it couldn't have been the government. The police are the government. I just wish they'd come up with some way to stop us. It'd be better that way. Wait, what do you mean? Why do you say that? There'll be no regrets, no tomorrows, no worries, no issues. And we wouldn't have to be here living this miserable life every single day, hoping for nothing. <laughs> it just doesn't seem worth it. Jake, we talked about this. I need you to continue being you. I mean, you're here for a reason. You may not see it now, but you'll see it someday in how much I need you. And we all need you. Sound like somebody's mother. <laughs> Look, you know, you can't change my mind. I just don't want to be here anymore. Look, if you weren't supposed to be here, you wouldn't be. I mean, you have a purpose for your life. There's greatness in you. The world will see it. You just just go kill yourself and get it over with. Really, Ashley? What? Shh. You drunk bitch. Why don't you just do it for me? I'm not drunk. What? I had one mimosa for breakfast. I'm so sick and tired of his weak, I want to die bullshit. He just wants attention. I, I, who does that? Who, who sits and, and just complains to everyone about every single stupid little thing? I mean, it'd help if you just act like you cared. Oh, whatever. My 10-year-old cousin got killed in a car accident, so I just hate people who don't appreciate life. I mean, Jake's got his rich little father and his rich little mother and all this money, and he's depressed. My mom's at home right now with both of her breasts cut off from cancer. And do you see me complaining about anything? Um, kind of, sort of, right now. I hope you're scheduled to work the night shift at the gym next weekend. I've already told everybody about the annual gala. 
In order to work that shift, I have to switch with Rob this week, and I need to work this week because I really need the money. Don't go trying to change the plan. Why don't you just work both? Work this week and next. No, we can't take any chances. Fine, I'll give you some money. How much you need? I got 50 bucks. You can have it. If you're passing it out, I'll take it. Okay, okay. Let me try to catch Rob now. So, did you tell Carson about the party? No. I'm not ready for that right now. What? I think you should tell him. I know he'll come. I'm just not ready to see him right now. Lena, you can't keep being mad at him. It's not his fault. He was upset about the situation just as much as you were. You make it sound like it's so easy, like it's nothing. I'm just saying it like it is. I just, I think I'm just gonna go to chapel this Sunday. I really need to get my mind off of Carson and off the whole thing. And chapel's gonna do that? Hmm. Take your boy Jake with you. He needs Jesus too. Hey mom. I'm fine. Yeah, I think I made the right decision. Huh? No, I'm not gonna come home right now. I just need some time away. Just let me finish the program. Yeah. I said I'm fine. Okay. Tell Bobby I'll call him later. Okay. Bye. Who is it? Oh my god, Tyler, you scared me for a second. Beautiful. You're just so beautiful. You're the one I want to know. You're just so beautiful. Your eyes are filled with light. Your heart is full of love. You're sent from up above. I see you're beautiful. Wow, that was really good. You know, you should be getting paid for your music. You're really that good. <laughs> nah, I just do it for fun when I find motivation to do it. Hmm. Well, what motivates you? Uh, things that move my heart, things that are lovely, things that encourage me to be better each day. Hmm. Well, what encourages you? For starters, you. <laughs> Stop. No, really. What encourages you? I'm serious. You do. I find hope every time I'm around you. You just make me feel good about myself. You make me feel like a man. Wow, that's sweet. Um, you're such a nice person, but you know there's nothing, you know, nothing between you and me. I mean, I like you, but as a friend. Y yeah, I know, Lee. Yeah, I, I don't want anything from you. No strings attached. Just your friendship. Hey, it's after seven? How'd you get past the RA? Come on, I know my way around. Okay, so you know that if I get caught with a guy in my room, I'll have early check-in and curfew next weekend. Trust me, I won't get caught. Oh, is the party still next weekend? Yeah, the gala? <laughs> yeah, that's why you can't get caught. Um, Ashley's trying to work the night shift, so she'll have the key. Cool. Oh. Hold on a sec. Hey, I'm sorry, I have to take this. Yeah, yeah, I understand. Yeah, no problem. And you're not supposed to be in here anyway. You want to meet me at chapel on Sunday? Yeah, sure. Cool. Sh sure, yeah. Okay, cool. Hey, and invite Jake, too. <laughs> hey. Hey, Tyler. How'd it go? Did she cry? No, she didn't say anything. I don't know, she never does. Got company? What? Oh, no. Then who was that? Who was who? Whoever you just talking to. Oh, nobody. <laughs> there was someone. Who was it? Do we have to do this right now? Now you just tell me who that was. What are you hiding? I'm not hiding anything. Look, I don't want to do this. Well, I love that song, so I'm sure she liked it. 
I don't know. She she kicked me out. She seems to be a more interesting athlete. Okay, bye. Girl, why is your door unlocked? <laughs> Hold on, it's Dee Dee. Oh, sorry. Who is it? Carson. Oh, turn the phone to me. Hey, Carson! <laughs> no wonder Tyler was mad. Wait, why was he mad? I don't care. Let me just talk to Carson. Fine. What's wrong? Nothing. So, how's baseball camp? Since when you care about that? Since I cared about you. Can I come see you? I'm like 60 miles away. I don't care if you're 6,000 miles away, Lena. You know I came here to get away for a moment. From everyone, everything. What are you trying to get away from? Me? You're running away from me? It's not you. It's just the situation. And I'm not running. I'm just trying to find my peace. I haven't found it yet. What do you mean? I don't know what I mean. I just, I feel like something worse is going to happen. I just feel like I'm in trouble. Like punishment is gonna. Punishment from what, Lena? What is wrong with you? Everything's okay. It wasn't your fault. All right. And everything's gonna be fine. Especially when I come up and visit. I don't know. We'll see. Do you know that God has given us the power to speak things into existence? He says that we can have whatever we say. Now, have you ever wondered that where you are today might be a direct result of what you've been saying? That's right. So, what are you saying? Now, do you want good grades in school? Then declare it. Do you want joy and peace in your life? Then find where God talks about it in his holy word and speak that over your life. Don't say things that you don't want or that you already have. Change your words to say what God through Christ Jesus has already promised you. You see, he promises us an abundant and prosperous life full of joy, peace, happiness. And, you know, I sure hope that I hear all of you speak these things over yourselves. And if someone here today has yet to ask Jesus Christ to be their Lord and Savior, now is the time. So, I invite you to pray with me. Jesus, I need you. Come into my life as my Lord and Savior. Come into my life as my Lord and Savior. Amen. Amen. Hey, Pastor Ben. Well, hey, Lena. What can I do for you? So does helping someone make God happy? Um, yeah, helping someone is good. Why do you ask? Does it remove our sin? Um, why don't we have a sit down and talk? So that I want to make sure you understand. No, no, I'm OK. I have to go. But Lena, I really want to make sure you understand. Hey, I want to try and help as many people as I can. Oh my god, Tyler needs help. Look at this picture he just posted on Instagram. Oh, <laughs> I didn't see him today. I wonder what happened to him. I mean, he's probably making out with a stupid guitar somewhere. Oh no, wait, I did see him. He was in the weight room at the gym. Oh, Dang, he's been in the gym a lot lately. Well, I feel bad for him. I mean, he's trying to look like an athlete. I honestly don't understand people that kill themselves at the gym to try and look like some fake-ass person on Instagram. No, I'm gonna invite him over for pizza tonight. Oh, good, just ruin his workout. Come on, come over for pizza tonight. Keep me company. Fine. Okay. Hmm. I'm anxious for nothing. 
but I make my request known to God. With thanksgiving, and his peace guards my heart. Philippians 4, 6 through 7. I may have tribulation, but I am of good cheer because Jesus has overcome it all. John 16, 33. He's cleansed me of all unrighteousness. 1 John 1, 9. Hey, Bobby. I miss you. Really? Oh, my goodness. You're at Nana's right now? Oh, I didn't know they were going out of town. Oh, okay. You're like 10 minutes away. Yeah? You want to go get some ice cream? Yeah? Okay. All right. I'll see you in a minute. Okay. Bye. scared me. I don't know. I don't know. I just, I want to go home now. Just calm down. Let me find... Where'd she go? I, I want to go home. Okay. Oh, okay. Um, I, I want to go home. Okay. She just disappeared? Yeah. Dude, what did your brother say? Nothing. He was freaked out too. I mean, don't you think it's strange given my situation that this would happen? I don't understand what you're saying. I lost my baby. And this lady lost her baby. <laughs> it's just a coincidence. No. I don't know. I feel like when she was screaming for her baby, I should have been screaming for mine. Look, I think... Maybe your mind might be playing tricks on you. Like, you know, when you break up with your boyfriend and then everywhere you go, you see people that look like him. Maybe when I opened that door, I was opening my mind to find him. My child. But who was he? Okay, look, I think you're getting a little too deep. And, and how do you know it was a he? I don't, but the lady said boy. She said a boy. Lena, that lady has nothing to do with you. But then where did she go? I don't know. I just feel like it does have something to do with me. Oh, shit. We're supposed to be at the gym with Ashley and them. Ugh. Okay. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, God. Really? Eggs over pizza? The body's a perfectly crafted piece of art. I'm conscious of what goes in and what comes out. <laughs> yeah. You blow my goddamn high boy. <laughs> so, do y'all have any ideas on the science project? Well, I'm just trying to get my mind off of everything and just focus on that. I haven't thought about it. Hold on. What project? 
doesn't concern you. Oh. And, and I haven't really thought about it either. Well, I think we need to focus on it and do it. You know? Mm. Find out what happened. What happened? I already know what happened, I'm telling you. I know how, them, I know how the goddamn government is. Them folks do not give a fuck. Shit, they kicked me out of the group home because they asked to give a fuck. They don't want to sponsor me no more. Hey, you know we got you if you need anything. We wouldn't leave you hanging. Yeah. Who funds you? A little non-profit. Well then, what are you complaining about? I had to pay to come here. And if you don't, you get to come here for free with a stupid handout? No fucking handout. Look, I ain't got nowhere else to go shit. I only came in for the housing, man. That makes sense. <laughs> well, you know if you get the scholarship from the project, you'll get housing when school starts. No. Mm -hmm. I know that. Yeah. That's it. I, I mean, well, we can help you get it. Mm -hmm. You know? Do something good. Uh, right? Right, yeah. I mean, it's really interesting, and let's just think about it. Hey, Zach. I'm in, bro. Shut up. Hey, I think it's a good idea. We could put our brains together and come up with something and get it as a group, and then we could give it to Zach. Yeah, yeah. I like that idea. I don't. Why does he get it? He gets to come here for free, and I don't. Well, what do I get? Hey, man, it's all yours if we get it, because I probably won't be around to even see it. What? what? Don't say that, Jake. And Ashley, I don't think we can split scholarship money. Well, I want something if we get it. Well, look, y'all ass to figure out why them goddamn scorpions hurt. My ass to figure out how to kill them motherfuckers. <laughs> That's exactly what I was thinking. <laughs> See, I think it's a great idea. Okay. So, I already know that scorpions eat crickets and other bugs. So, bugs have to be present, and then a lot of scorpions have to be present that way, too. Y'all agree with that shit? Them goddamn things were killing folks. Girl, what in the hell is your ass talking about? No, I mean... <laughs> hey, Lena, I can help you with this. You know, scorpions glow like the sun. Like, my heart glows oh, when it's run over by love. Thanks. <laughs> All right. All right. <laughs> you want me to oh, Hey, Lena. Can we talk? I haven't been honest with you about everything. And it cannot continue this way. My mind cannot lead my heart. My heart leads. <laughs> okay, what are you talking about? My heart is without limits. And its destination continues to be you. Okay, stop. Look, I, I think I know where you're going with this. Tyler, you're super talented and I fun, enjoy but... Your presence. I like the way you speak and who you are. I see your beauty isn't just external, but internal, and, and it excites me. Look, I don't want to lead you on or make you feel like I, I want something more than a friend. No, 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 you, you're not leading me on. I understand what you're saying, but I just want to be sure you know how I feel. If something were to happen, I can say I told you. Wait, why would you say that? What? If something were to happen. You know, I could die any time, you never know. Tyler, why do you say that? Just Don't say anything so like serious. that. I was just making a reference. But maybe your heart will change. Uh, uh, look, no. My heart is with another, I'm sorry. And my heart's broken once again. Cut into pieces. Huh? My heart, my flesh, shattered for you. Look. There, I know there's some girls out there that would love to be with someone like you. Friends? If I don't have a choice, I guess. Okay. What do you think they are? I don't know. But they look like huge caterpillar nests, but bigger and satin. Oh, look, they're on that tree, too. Oh, if I end up with creepy crawlers in my room, I'm done. I'm going, I'm going home. I don't, I don't do bugs. Oh. So, from my research, I found that when temperatures are mild in the winter, communities are prone to scorpion infestations. 
Now in 1988, the average temperature that winter was 65 degrees, which is high. So my group and I conclude that mild winters are the cause of the outbreak. Lena, mild winters are not uncommon around here. In fact, we've had several with average temperatures about the same, but only one outbreak. I appreciate the effort, but I need something a little bit more concrete. Thank you. Continue with your dissection and document your findings. What does it look like? <laughs> mm. Oh, gross, dude. <laughs> like, ugh. you know, there are over 1,600 scorpion species in the world, but only like 25 actually have them that kill a motherfucker. Dang, I wish species hurt all those people. You know, see, that's the thing. The most deadly is one can't even live for and multiply. Most of them are like on Arabia and India or some shit. I don't even know what to represent because these are homeless just like those are. Well, we'll come up with something. I have to. I have to do this for you. But the ones in the video definitely weren't harmless. That's because them hoes will put hurt by people to hurt people. I keep trying to tell y'all. But who would do that? You already know my opinion. But like I said, don't want to listen. Well, if somebody's trying to hurt me, I got something for them. Well, what you got? Don't worry about all that. Just know they're gonna get got. Okay. <laughs> Girl! You missed a great class. We dissected this nasty, like, scorpion. Stop. Scorpion. I've been throwing up all morning, and my head hurts like hell. Girl, you need to cut back on that drinking. Cut back? <laughs> Are you crazy? I need to drink more shit. I'm probably gonna drink myself to death. Is it me? Or do these things get bigger? Hmm. I was wondering what the hell those were. Hey, what are you doing? What's wrong with you? They're just fucking bug nests. I don't know. Those look like nothing I've seen before. And there's so many of them. They're everywhere. And we don't know what's in them. Well, I'm about to find out. What? Don't do that. Are you crazy? What if, like, bees or something fly out? I'm not trying to get stung. <laughs> Don't be such a scaredy pants. See, I told you, there's nothing in it. Whatever. I'm getting out of here. Let's go, y'all. Something doesn't feel right. Carson? Gonna let me in? Yeah, sure. What are you doing here? I came to see you, Lena. How did you find me? Dee Dee. <sighs> Should've known. I missed you like crazy. I mean, I miss you too. You don't seem too happy to see me. Well, I wasn't ready just yet. It's been three months since... Yeah, three months and four days. I know. You ever wonder if it was a boy? Why did you say that? Or girl. No, you said boy first. Why did you say boy? I don't know, boy or girl. You ever wonder? All the time. We can always work on another. What? You think this is a joke? I didn't just lose my child. Our child. I lost my virginity. I lost my mind, my peace. I can't even think straight anymore. I can't even concentrate long enough without even thinking about it. And you're standing over here making dumb comments like that. You know what? I didn't even ask for you to come. Can you please leave? I just need to get my mind off of it, off of you, off everything. 
You're acting like I did something wrong, like everything's my fault. It is. If I would have gone home and not gone to your room, none of this would have ever happened. I didn't tell you to come. Look, I'm sorry for everything that's happened. But you can't put all the blame on me. I just want to move on and go back to being us. Why did you come? Because I love you, Lena. I'm not ready for love. I don't deserve love. What's that supposed to mean? Just go. I don't, I don't need this. Just go. What's wrong with you? I just told you what's wrong with me. Now, can you please just go? I have to figure something out. Figure what out? Lena, I just drove all the way out here just for you to put me out. I need to figure out what's going on. There's this lady. What lady? You know what? Never mind. I can't do this right now. Can you please just go? Maybe you can go hang out with Zach or Tyler or something. I don't know. I don't hang out with them. I came here to see you. Well, maybe you should have called. Now, can you please go? No. I'm not leaving. You know what? Fine. I will. That's not the only way to open it. <laughs> what are you talking about? There are more than one ways to open doors for me. Okay, who are you? And where's your son? Where's your baby? Where's yours? What? Why would you say that? Who are you? I'm just asking the same question that you ask yourself, right? Well, yeah, I guess. I have your answer. You still haven't told me what happened to your baby. He's fine. I have many children. They're born every day. Would you like to have one? Is this some sort of sick joke? Just say it, Lena! How do you know my name? Just say it! What do you want me to say? I can help you. Give you all that you want. Just say that you need me in your life. Say it! Pastor Ben? Yeah. Yeah, no, I'm fine. Yeah, yeah. Okay, bye. <laughs> I mean, it sounds like the same. Hey, did you get one of your friends to, um, from music school to DJ? Yeah, I asked one of the new guys. He's dope. Everyone like him. Yo, so what's that my boy Carson. What up, boy? What's up, Zach? Cool, Zach. Good. Uh, <laughs> yeah. What's up, so, guys? Hey, Carson. Hey, our annual uh, gala is on Saturday. You coming up? What time? Oh, come on, Carson. You know we got all the night long. Is Lena going? Did she not tell you? I know she's a goody two shoes, and she doesn't do this, and she doesn't do that. But she can kick off her shoes for one night. Where is she anyway? I don't know. She left a while ago. Is everything okay? Yeah, yeah. Everything's good. I gotta get back to my side of town. Oh man. We just about to goddamn hit the court dogs and toilet paper. You know that white folk shit. <laughs> <laughs> so, it's fun. Jake's mom sent some boxes of stuff. Just got toilet paper for days. It's not even like he's gonna notice or care. I'm good. Looks like someone already did that. Oh no, that's um, one of those summer tree balloons. I already poked a hole in it. There's nothing in it. Looks like balloons, but I'll see y'all later. Wait, Saturday? Yeah, okay. What's up, Tyler?
guys stop by the cafe? Uh, see you guys later. Wait, wait, I'm hungry. Right. I'll come with you. Let's fuck this shit up. <laughs> Bro, it's gonna look ridiculous. Fuck Straight this school, up, man. Fuck this school. Let's go, Larry. Alright, alright, alright. Jakey Poo, mm. open up. Hold up. Um, Where is he? Voicemail, voicemail. Is, is, is Jake at the cafe? I have no idea. Can we just go in and take it? It's not like he's gonna even notice. Come on. He's got plenty. Girl, you want some damn toilet paper that bad? Yes, I wanna fucking get the courtyard. Hold up, hold up. Watch this, watch this, watch this. Jake! Hey, 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 hey man. Can, can you um, open up the door for my room? I'll, I'll lock myself out. No, you know there's no girls after seven. Oh, oh, listen, 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 listen. Man, that's not a goddamn girl. That's a crazy ass psychopath. What? She left her meds in her. Come on, bro. Oh, all this shit is in this closet. What the fuck y'all need chainsaws for? <laughs> oh, that thing. We rented it. I gotta cut down some of the tree limbs and stuff in the courtyard. Other stuff hanging that don't belong there. Wow. But for some reason, it just didn't work when I tried it. So, mm. hey, look. If you need somebody to help you, man, I got you. Really? Yeah. Yeah. Yes, sir. What room? Oh, here. Thanks, man. Thanks, man. I think, I think he keeps it under the sink. You know, Jake frowns on all of his photos, man. The only time he smiles when his ass is high. Found it. Hmm. Damn. Damn, we gonna get out of it? Shit. Wait, Jake? Damn, man, you know he was laying there. Jake, wake up, man. You know, the only one you really truly need is Jesus Christ. Something just doesn't seem right about this person. I think I'm losing my mind, Pastor Ben. <laughs> you know, you shouldn't say things like that, Lena. D try to say things like, things don't seem to make sense right now, but they will soon. Or ask God, God help me to see things more clearly. Yeah, say what you want, right. I get it. You know, Lena, it's not a joke. You'd be surprised how much authority your words really have over your life. Does God love me? No matter what? Yes, he does. No matter. Explain to me again why you're in this room. I already told you like three times already, man. The story's not gonna change. What the hell was that thing? What was it? Did you find that stupid thing? We checked the vents, didn't find anything. Are you sure it was a crab? Yeah, I'm sure. You fucking kidding me? Right. It had a roundy body with three claws. Not as many legs as a crab, though. And, and it had a dark color. Maybe soft. I don't know, it happened so fast, I'm not sure. Anyone around here have crabs as pets that you know of? Not that I've seen. What? We're not allowed to have pets. Fuck. Well, I'm gonna need you to come down to the station with me and so I can ask you a few more questions. You know, get a little more information. Why in the fuck are you looking at me? Cause I'm black, huh? Oh, I get it. Take the black man down to the station to get some more black ass information, huh? You need to calm down. Not just you. I need both of you to come. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. Whatever. I hear you. Take some more folks down. That's all look as obvious, man. You ready? Let's go. Yeah. You need to watch yourself, son. You don't need me? Oh, you're good. I never thought he'd do it. What? Take his own life. He said it before, but... People say it all the time, but... But what? People say it all the time, but never actually do it. How, how do you know he did it, Lena? You didn't see what we saw. There was something in there, and it looked like it was eating him. Something like what? Like a roach or something? 
I see water bugs all the time. It wasn't a roach. If that was a roach, it was one big ass, ugly ass, long legged roach. They take the body out. Oh my god. I can't watch. Did you see that? Yeah. I can't believe it came. His end came so soon. We are deeply saddened by the loss of our beloved student, Jake Webb. I ask that you just continue to lift his family up in prayer. We have sent communication. Now, I know that you are all adults, but I do think it would be a good idea if you contacted your parents and let them know that you're okay. Counselors will be available all week long for anyone who wants it. Hey, what happened? They kept us overnight and kept asking us the same questions over and over again. Man, I stopped talking. So I already told y'all what happened. If no attorney is present, I ain't saying nothing else. Either you're gonna arrest us or let us go. And shit, they let us go. Well, they don't think you did anything, do they? Damn, what they think? We was there, we know what happened. Hey, there's Jake's brother. The family said that the police have ruled it a suicide. So you have no reason to be afraid on campus. And they don't want his friends to be sad. When the police say that? They told the school and the um, family yesterday evening. Well, can we go to the funeral? Unfortunately, they're flying the body back to Jake's hometown of South Carolina, and the service is gonna be private. Excuse me. You heard her. It sounds like it's still going on. What? You're still trying to party on Saturday? Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Did you not hear what Miss Reynolds just said? It's what the family wanted. We grieved. I moved on. I'm done with the police. I'm done with this. Hey, can you remind Tyler to bring one of his music freak DJs? But they never found that thing. They should be trying to catch it. We don't know where it went. I mean, it's probably dead by now. And it doesn't matter. It was a suicide. Can you remind Tyler? Yeah, I'll tell him. What's wrong with you? <sighs> Nothing. Maybe the party won't be such a bad idea. It'll help us get our mind off things. I'm about tired of this bullshit, too. I'm in. Ash, what you got to drink? I know you got something to drink. Of course I have something to drink. I've got a lot. It's all in my room. It's going to be freaking crazy. Yes. <laughs> and his peace guards my heart. Hello? Hey, Mom. What? What? Why does this keep happening? Who is it? Well, damn, just come on in, why don't you? How's your mother? Her cancer. <laughs> Not good. Um, no tatas. She's got. Scars all over here and here. I could probably play Tic Tac Joe on her chest. And she's single, so I don't know how she's gonna get a man. But is she all right? No, did, did you not just hear what I said? Like, anybody there? They found a lump on my dad that might be cancerous. Damn, fucking monster is out to get everybody. Why is all this happening? I feel like I'm gonna lose, I mean, God help me understand. Here, take this. Works like a charm. Best meds there is. <coughs> oh my God! <laughs> what is this? AK. What's AK? All kind of liquor. Give me that back. I'm probably gonna die drinking. Pastor Ben says you shouldn't say stuff like that. Well, tell Pastor Ben that I'm probably going to drink myself to death. 
<laughs> so, Ms. Reynolds, in class, I've done a little research and found some interesting information. And these old photos is from a scene in 1988. Does anything stand out to you guys? Tell us what you found. In each photo, the same person is present. Now, I enlarged this one, but it's the same person. It looks like an old Caucasian woman, maybe seven years old. But it gets even clever. Our person with the cap is wearing the same thing as a person with the box. I say it's the same person. Who is it? The FBI. Ms. Reynolds, I think this proves my conclusion that they was government involvement. Why would the same person be in every photo and be placing creepy boxes? I have to say that what you found is very interesting, but it does not necessarily prove anything. I think you're on to something, Zach, but wow. keep searching. Okay. All right. All right. Maybe you're just seeing things. I can't believe you went back there again. D. I didn't even realize it was the same store until now. That lady looks exactly the same 30 years later. I mean, that's strange, and none of this makes any sense. I mean, I just gotta go back and find some information. Well, what happened to her son? I told you she said she had many, but she just disappeared, just vanished again. Uh, what came out of the door? Nothing from what I saw. So who went in? I don't know. She did say something about the door not being the only way and her children. I don't know, but none of this makes any sense. Maybe we can find out more information. I know you do not want to go back there again. Girl, I am not about that shit. You're right. I should probably go back by myself. I just really need to find out who she is and what this all is. You're not going by yourself, okay? Okay, fine, I'll go. But I'm taking Shelly. Who? You know. And we have to be back by the time for the gala. Okay. Lena, what the hell made you come to this creepy ass place in the first place? Wait, the doors are gone. What doors? The doors. The same ones from the video? They were here last time. The same ones I opened, they're gone. Okay, so what does that mean? Like, like somebody painted on top of them or, or put something over it? She did say there were more ways to open them for her. What the hell does that mean? I don't know, but I feel like, I feel like whatever was in there wanted out. Something was in there, and I may have let it out. <laughs> what the hell was that? No, we need to get the hell up out of here. I ain't sticking around to see whatever got loose. Lena, I can't believe we came here. This isn't safe. We should have brought more people. Yeah, okay, let's go. Are you guys just getting here? Oh my god, I can't hear anything. Turn up. Turn it. Hey. hey. Have you guys seen Lena? What? What? Have you guys seen Lena?
Lena. I started to think you weren't going to come. You know, just casually like... This has really grown since last year. I know, right? I mean, like my heart is going for you. <laughs> Gosh, Tyler, you're so sweet. <laughs> hey, look, I got a little Joe and Warren to play. Who? You know, the other one robbed you. Not a personal favorite, but everybody likes them. Lena! 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 God, I've been looking all over for you. <laughs> Girl, what's wrong with you? Why are you hiding out? I have this strange feeling. Mm. Carson. What? No! Did you notice the cocoons? What? You know? The ones on the trees? The cocoons on the trees. Oh! Yeah, what about them? They hatched. <laughs> Girl, what are you talking about? They hatched. There was nothing in them. Not from what I saw. Whenever I pass by them, I just got this really strange feeling like... Yesterday, they were all like big, and today they're all like small. Okay, girl, girl, you are so strange. This whole situation is strange. Wait, did you hear that? Oh, yeah, I love this song. No, that. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, flashlight. Woohoo! Turn up! Somebody's in trouble. And? I'm on the town's campus where camp is in session. We received reports that the campus was under attack by a crab-like creature. We we're unsure if there are any injured or if there are any deaths. Keep in mind, a similar incident occurred at this very same location almost 30 years ago. The mystery behind the creature was never solved, but believed to be caused by students. Excuse me, can you tell us what happened here? Any notes? Can you tell us what happened here? Lena, marry me. Say you'll be with me. What? I, I don't know what's happening or if the world is coming to an end, but if it does, I want to spend the end with you. I love you. Oh my God, Tyler. 
I think we just witnessed a marriage proposal? Strange sequence of events here. Crab attacks, police, gunshots, and now this. I've never seen anything like it before, but we'll get to the bottom of it. Why would you do this? I told you I don't want to be with you. I love you. I'm, I know you love me. I, I can see it in your eyes. I told you I don't want to be with you, Tyler. How could you think about something like this right now? You're crazy. I'm crazy in love with you. Oh my God, stop it. Just stop it. You don't love me. God doesn't even love me because he wouldn't even be doing this right now. Just get over it. I can't. You have no choice. Just leave me alone. I'm cut into pieces. Stop saying that. Leave me alone, Tyler. We love you, Lena. Say you love us, too. <laughs> I don't love you. Who are you? Leave me alone. <laughs> oh my god going on this is crazy this was a whole setup by the fucking whoa mafia. whoa where are you going no 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 i'm out of here y'all can have this crab infested school no one can be out right now i need you to go to your room who the fuck that go to your rooms oh shit come on y'all come on just go man Fuck. i am hallucinating <laughs> this is don't trust these motherfuckers they're getting on my fucking Fucking skin! Fuck! You know what? We ain't got nothing to worry about. How many rounds you got left? Uh, I got a case in my room. Okay, cool, 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 cool. cool. I'm gonna call my parents. Who the fuck I'm gonna call, huh? Not gonna let me stay with y'all? Huh? You gonna let me stay with you? Huh? If they even let us out this bitch, man. Fuck this shit, man. Oh my god. Look, they're talking about us on TV. Residents of our town are requesting that you can't be quarantined to prevent the spread of pests. What are, you, what are you fucking kidding me? They, they, they can't keep us here. This, this gotta be like a violation against our rights or something. I already told you, Ashley. They don't give a fuck about rights. Them folks are experimenting with us just like they did in Tuskegee. The government is behind this shit. What are you talking about? The fucking Tuskegee experiment. The motherfucking government worked for Tuskegee University to do a study on syphilis. Those crowds are way too fucking big to be an STD. They just injected poor black people with this syphilis virus. To study the disease or something, man. I don't fucking know, man. But I'm not a poor black person. To trouble young adults just like us. They ain't for people that can't fight for themselves. <laughs> they better rethink that. I will fight to the death. I ain't playing with nobody. So what happened to the experiment? <sighs> All right, so it was supposed to last for a few months. But it ended up lasting for 40 years or some shit like that. And the people that was injected didn't even know they was infected. They were left untreated. You know what's so fucked up? The government knew this shit the whole time. They just left them untreated, just fucked up, right? There's right? There's no way they can keep us for that long, no fucking way. But why would the government do that? Because if you're not rich and white, they don't give a fuck. Okay, I don't think I understand this experiment and how it relates to us. <laughs> Me either. Wait, was that woman involved? What? Never mind. What you mean you don't get it? These motherfuckers let crabs out on our heads. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Maybe, 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 maybe they were doing a test on war weapons or something. You know, to see how much harm it can do. I don't it's fucking know, stupid. Man. Yes, I know it's fucking stupid because they do stupid motherfucking things. Because they stupid motherfucking people. Well, they're not going to do it to us. We got to get out of here. I'm not letting no crabs eat me. So how do we end this? This experiment, the crabs are all dead. 
I mean, whatever they were trying to do, it didn't work. So we're just gonna have to tell them that, that it didn't work. They'll have to let us go. That's not that's not that's not that's not Hey guys, do y'all hear? We're getting quarantined. Tyler, Tyler, I know, I know. We just gotta make sure these things are gone, man. Come on, Tyler, let's go, bro. All right, all right, Tyler, y'all later. So where are we going? The janitor's closet. I found something that we can use. Back up. Dust to kill scorpions. Here. What? I thought they were crabs. They look like crabs. How the fuck a crab come from a fucking cocoon? We don't know what the fuck these motherfuckers is. We're gonna put this shit out tonight, alright? Alright. Cause you're good, bro. Here, go. Why? Alright. What do you got there? D powder. What kind of powder? I need you to stop. Sir, it'll kill the creatures if there are any. So you know where they are then? Nah, but I bet your ass do. Hmm? Sir, we're not sure, but we're just trying to keep them away from coming back. Well, how do I know what you're putting down won't make them multiply? What? Here it is, yeah. You sound dumb as fuck. Why would we put this shit down for it to multiply to kill all of us? You need to calm the fuck down. This man's pissing me off, boy. Get exactly, him exactly. Man. Calm down, calm down, sir. We're upset about this, about everything. It's ruining our lives. I understand, but I need to test it first. Test all you want. Where are you gonna go, huh? And after I get this tested, I'll let you know if you can continue. But until this... then, Ooh. you have to stop. Boy, this is some bullshit. Of course they'll say that. Come on, man. Hey, grab it. We'll yeah. put this shit out everywhere else around the dome. Fuck it. <clears throat> why, why, why are you saying something now? Like, where, where is this store? Uh, about 15 minutes from here. <laughs> Man, hell no. Hell no, man. What, 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 what? Do we know how to get out yet? I haven't got this bitch one way or another. I don't trust none of y'all motherfuckers. Y'all talking about the FBI and not saying shit? What's that supposed to mean? I don't know if you motherfuckers are with us or with them. So you think I got something to do with it? I don't know who got what? Hold up. None of us have anything to do with this. I just need a fucking drink. <laughs> the crabs are all gone, guys. Why don't we talk to the media? Just show them they're gone. Maybe they let us go. Where are you going? My mom's calling me. Hold on. Here she go, man. No, I'm fine. Yeah. No, I don't know what's going on. What? You saw that? No, I'm not engaged. I don't know. He's just some crazy guy. Yeah. No, we're just stuck. I'm fine. Look, I have a lot of people in my room. I gotta go. Hey, me and Ashley are gonna stay here tonight, okay? That's fine. Hey, uh, can I stay here too? Uh, no, on, you come need come to go on, with Zach. Come on, come on boy. We come need on, to sit together, come on, boy. Though. It's time for me to prepare you for your 15 minutes of fame, you know? Hey, and don't be singing any of your stupid songs. Hey, but I like this song. Hey, yo, don't pay. Come on, boy. All right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. As you can see, uh, we have treated the campus. We have done a thorough search and it is clear, no more creatures are in sight. Now, I'm not allowed to go beyond this point, but our camera will try to capture as much footage as possible. Now, how can you be certain the creatures, as you call them, are gone? What, what happened to them? Uh, well, they were killed by the students and the police, so there is no threat. Uh, no, no reason to keep us here. If the school or government were experimenting, the experiment has failed. Are you saying that the school was in fact experimenting? Uh, no, 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 that's not what I was saying. Uh, I can assure you that they, uh, we weren't, and uh, you know, we are trying to connect with our loved ones. How do you think it's going? I bet he's screwing it up right now. Yeah, I bet it, he's making it worse. 
He's so pathetic. I should have done it. Why'd you choose a loser to speak, Zach? Didi should have shot him. What? Zach. Why would you say that? Because she should have. Zach. Hey, where's Didi? In our room. Gotta go to the restroom. All right, I'm back. I. How was it him? Looks like he saw a ghost or something. I don't know. I'm gonna go check it out. Put some shit in Ashley. What? I'm one of the motherfucking things, man. I saw it. I saw the thing cross her neck. It crossed her neck. Well, why didn't you kill it? It was underneath. What? It was underneath her skin. They don't put that shit in her ass. They don't inject her in her ass with that shit, man. Hell no. Hell no. No, no, no. Calm no, down. No. So who injected what? That's what I'm trying, that's what I'm trying to figure out. They done injected the motherfucking things in her. They done put that shit in Ashley. And how did they do that? I don't know, but they did. I gotta get the hell up out of here. Cause I swear, if they try to put that shit on me, I'm gonna do something about it. I promise you, I can't do it. I gotta get the fuck up out of here. Let's just ask Ashley. Maybe it's something that you saw. Maybe you really didn't no, see it. No, 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 man. Fuck. Let me see where she's at. Oh, She's in front of the cafe. Oh, God. Come on, let's go. Oh, God. Come on. Oh, God. oh hell no. Come hell on. no. Hey, where's Tyler? Me and that reporter wanted to go talk to the president. What's wrong with your ass? Uh, are you okay? Yeah, I'm okay. Are you okay? We were just concerned about you. Why are you concerned about me? I mean, I should be concerned about y'all, especially his crazy ass. So, um, when you went to the police station, um, what happened? What is this? You know what happened. Well, did anyone inject you with anything? Why would they do that? I don't know. To give you medication or something like that? What? You think that I'm on medication? Like, no. like I'm crazy? No. You're the fucking crazy one, you stupid bitch. You think you're so much better than everyone, Miss Goody Two Shoes, Miss I think I'm perfect, bitch. Ashley, where is this all coming from? Where the hell are your questions coming from? Like you're standing there, like like something is wrong with me. Something is wrong with your ass. You're the one that's fucking crazy. You're the one. You know what? They they say that the good ones that pretend that they're actually good have one foot in hell. You're not fucking perfect, you stupid bitch. I ain't finna be too many stupid bitches. Oh uh, yeah, what are you gonna do? You know what? Get a fucking drink. You kiss my ass. I don't know what's up with her. What? I totally put that shit in her. That bitch is possessed. And the goddamn government, I don't even wanna sit right there. The government do what the fuck they wanna do. Shit, they probably put that shit in her while she was asleep. She slept in my room last night. Well, your ass might got it too, man. Well, you don't see me acting like that. Mm -hmm. You told Ashley. Told Ashley what? Never mind. Okay. There's no need to be concerned. We're hoping to let the students leave by tomorrow. It's not that. Well, what's going on? All summer I felt like something bad was gonna happen. I just knew something was gonna happen. This is all my fault. Well, I don't quite understand what's happening on campus, but I don't think this is your fault. Why do you blame yourself? Pastor Ben, I'm not a good person. I did some things. 
I, well, I we've don't... all done some things that we're not proud of. Not like me. Right before I came to camp, I got into trouble. And I feel like God is here to punish me. Well, what sort of trouble? I got pregnant. I didn't mean to. It, it happened all so fast. I had planned on being married before any of this ever happened. I made a mistake. Lena, what you did may not have been right, but I can assure you that God is not after you. But you don't know what I did. Do your parents know that you're pregnant? I'm not pregnant anymore. I told Carson I had a miscarriage. Carson McDaniel, the one from last summer. I told him I had a miscarriage, but I didn't, Pastor Ben. I had an abortion. And I'm sorry. I am so sorry. I never meant for any of this to happen. This is all my fault. Those things were here for me. This is all my fault. I thought if I could just help someone out that all this would go away. I don't know what to do. I'm sorry about what you went through, but it sounds like you are too. I know God is not after you. When you're in Christ, all your sins have been dealt with. And the punishment was placed in the body of Christ Jesus. So he's not trying to punish you. God sees you as perfect in Christ. But I'm not. It's all a front. I just act like it. I deserve to be punished. Now that's what the devil wants you to think. I'm not saying that what you did is right. But your right relationship with God is not based upon your works. It's based upon what Jesus did for you on the cross. If this weren't the case, we'd all be in trouble. Hi. Lena, are you okay? Are you okay to talk to her? Yeah, thanks. I'm okay. You call yourself a pest. Who are you? Pastors aren't like you. You have no business being one. What are you talking about? Practice what you pre preach. I do. Do you really? Pastors don't commit adultery. What? That was 20 years ago. And she left! I remember it like yesterday. What a shame. It is written, if you do not obey the Lord, your God, all curses will overtake you! I was wrong. I wish that I could take it back. But I can't! Jenny! I'm so sorry! 
Now, now. Come to me and my children. But Jesus redeemed me from the curse of the law. Lies! He was wounded for my transgressions. He became a curse for me. Shut up! Oh, lies! I am the righteousness of God in Christ Jesus. That's it. That's it. That's it. Pastor Ben, we need you to come with us. For what? Look, I know what they are, and I know why they're here. I need to let the others... We have reason to believe you've been assisting students in leaving campus and in spreading your experiment. What? What are you talking about? I need you to come to the station with me. Get out, man. Well, what the fuck? How the fuck you get out? Man zipped out of the media. The police did not even notice. As soon as they turned their heads, I was in my car. Right. Motherfuckers don't know how to watch. <laughs> Where you headed? Man, I went back home for a minute. You know, going back to the campus now. How the fuck you going back for? You know, my music, motivation is back there. Man, your ass is crazy. <laughs> you to find some more motherfucking motivation. Man, my boy Carson's up the street. Plus, me picking my ass up. Been waiting on his ass for like two hours. Put him over here. Hey, uh, Carson, who? You know Lens, boy. There you go. What's up with that? Had a joke or something? Oh man, uh, it, it... Watch out! Ah, Tyler! Uh, help me, man! Don't just fucking stand up, bro! Come on! Uh, Listen! Uh, don't just fucking stand up, man! Come on, help me! Tyler! Come on, bro! Come on, come on, come on, come on! Come on. Uh, oh. Go away. I said go away. I'm itching like crazy right now. How many drinks have you had? Aaron, don't come in here with that bullshit. I drink as much as I want. You really need to slow down. You really need to shut the fuck up talking to me right now. I don't know what's happening with you, but you're acting strange. Because she's drunk. She wasn't earlier, and she was still acting this way. You know, I can hear you, you stupid bitch. You ready to admit that you're the bitchiest of bitches? Hold on, you're not going to keep talking to us like that. I'm not talking to you. I'm talking to that bitch. OK, yes, Ashley. Yes, I've done bad things, but that's not who I am. And you can't keep trying to make me feel bad about it. I don't do that to you. Shut up. I see the way that you look at me. You're, you're always looking at me. Up and down, up and down, up and down. Like, like you're perfect, and I'm not. Look at you, bitch. You're doing it right now. Up and down. Oh, my God. Are you okay? Ashley! Oh my god! 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 Oh my god
So that's it? Yes, this is probably why they haven't been able to attack you or me either. Don't let the devil, that woman, shame or continue. There's no condemnation for those in Christ Jesus. Don't let her do it. Lena? They want to speak to you. Lena? She's sweet. Come back later.
You have no power over me. It's the other way around. I have power over you. And with the authority in me, and the power in me, I command you to flee. You aren't welcome here. I speak peace into this hallway, in this place, and in this town. I command you to flee in the mighty name of Jesus. You were dead. I thought I was almost too. I don't know how, but I slid underneath the the thing. I don't know how, but I didn't get hit. I'm so sorry. Sorry for what? For everything. For not being truthful. What are you talking about? I want us to start over. Can we go back to being us? Yeah, Lena. We're always us. No, I mean the right us. The way things were when we first met. I want to have a right relationship with you. I want it to be pure and with you. I do too. I want to marry you. Is that a proposal? If you want it to be. I'm just kidding. I'm not ready for that yet. Good. Because I'm supposed to ask you that. Can't wear the skirt and the pants. And why not? Well, you can. If you want to. <laughs> I missed you, Lita. I missed you, too. So what you're saying is that the students caused this by what they were saying? Yes. I'm confused. Help me understand this. Well, words have more power than people realize. People create their own circumstances by what they allow in their lives and by the words that come out of their mouths. So that's your explanation for what happened here? You saw it here. I mean, but it's happening everywhere. Words are just a door inviting what you speak, whether good or evil. Crabs crawl, students are attacked, and two commit suicide. The culprit, your words. Cut. Stop. You have got to be kidding me. I'll probably get fired for not coming back with something. Lena, thank you. He has spoken. You never said how Didi was doing. Good. She's at home. With all that's happening, I'm just glad you were able to walk away with a scholarship. You know your dad gets his test results today. God's not holding that against me. It's been dealt with on the cross. He loves me. You were only one of many. You think you're smart? Think you've figured it out? You may stop. But they never will. I have 
figured it out. I know I'm loved, and you have no power over me. You get out of here in the name of Jesus. They are always talking, and I am always listening. They welcome me back again and again and again. One way or another, they always welcome my children into their lives. I'm so stupid. I can never get this right. Did Dad come out yet? Not yet. Results. Don't know just yet. You know my father had cancer. And my grandfather. I bet. You're healthy. Don't ever talk like that, Dad. Ever. Never talk like that. Hello? The results are good. It's benign. Oh, yes. You're fine. Yes. <laughs> Wonderful. 